Hi Sagittarius, babies, what's up, what's up, what's up, up? This is a collective message for all my Sag babies. Flip it, switch it, get in where you fit in, leave the rest. There's no gender in tarot, okay? If it does not apply, let it fly, leave it for somebody else. This is a collective message for all my Sag babies. I hope y'all are having a good and prosperous day. It's Friday, okay? The last day of the cancer season special, okay, for 2750. This is definitely your last day. So if you want to get a personal reading with your girl, just hit the description tab on the page under the bio. You can also see other content of me as well, Sag, okay? Uh, all my new subscribers that are Sagges, hello, how y'all doing? All my old subscribers, y'all the realest, okay? So please. Like, love, and share the video. Likes are appreciated. Sharing is caring. And I love y'all comments, okay? So this is a collective reading. Take what resonates and leave the rest. So if I, God, just send a master's universe and spirit, please give my sass babies a message, okay? We have work through your fears. So there's some fears you might be holding on to. You got to work through that. Baby work out. I'm hearing baby work out. Okay. Also, look at the bigger picture, Sag. Full moon and Sagittarius. Okay. Working through your fears. Fear. <laughs> Working through your fears is new moon and Scorpio. Okay. And Sagittarius, you're definitely out in your reading. I love it. Okay. Full moon in Aquarius. Show the world the world you. Okay. So, Sagittarius, y'all are very medic, okay? Loving, honest people. Uh, the boost of the party. We want you to show the world the real sadness, okay? I like that, okay? So let's see. Let's capitalize this situation with some tarot. Okay. Let's capitalize this with some tarot. Okay, we got Ace of Wands and the Four of Wands and the Queen of Cups. So if some of y'all are in the Pisces Cancer Scorpio energy, or you can have Pisces Cancer Scorpio in your chart, okay? But you're definitely taking action when it comes to your stability. I like that. You're making a wish fulfillment come true, okay? You're interacting with people. Maybe you're having a new project that you're trying to create. You know, getting connected to your desires the best way you can. You're with celebrating and joyful, you know. A lot of fire energy, okay? So you're in your element, okay? Your love and caring and sweet. It's a nurturing kind of element. So you are definitely in your element. You're definitely grateful for everything and complaining about nothing. Everything's pretty much going, how they say, call for aesthetic. Look at the big up pictures, okay? With the Knight of Wands, the Seven of Cups in reverse, and the Page of Wands. Spirit was actually looking, observing to see how you're going to act under pressure, Sag, okay? With the Seven of Cups, it came to a point in your life, you felt like you had no other choice, but actually you do. Your press was answered, okay? Spirit wants you to know you do have many of choices. Give me some more on that Seven of Cups in reverse. Give me some more on that, okay? It had the five of swords. Give me some more on that. Five of swords, okay? Yeah, you felt like you were defeated, okay? Aquarius energy. Maybe you have Aquarius in your chart, okay? There was a lot of challenges, okay? Loss of direction came your way with the five of wands in reverse, okay? But you took, you took action with the ace of cups. I'm sorry. With the Ace of Cups, you definitely emotionally took action, okay? And now you have room to celebrate with the Three of Cups, okay? Show the world the real you. Yeah. Page of Cups, okay? And the Four of Pentacles, okay? So with the Page of Cups and Four of Pentacles, you created something of your own. You created your own opportunity with the six of pentacles kind of peeking out there. Yeah. You created the love that you needed. Okay. You started to begin to save money. 
holding on, saving money, being secure within oneself, taking your control back, okay? So basically, financially, you know, you went through some heartaches, some hardships, everybody does, okay? And with the page of one, you were inspired to get a new opportunity. Congratulations, okay? With the Knight of Cups, you pouring into this. Spirit is definitely grateful with the temperance, okay? I love that's my spirit part. Spirit got your back, okay? How they say, never complain, always grateful, okay? Yes, you have room to celebrate with the Three of Pentacles. The Spirit wants you to know instead of taking action, you actually got your way through. Through the obstacles, you found something that was wish fulfillment. It didn't jeopardize your stability at all. You are in your Empress energy. You're in conference, so this is a definitely a good week for you, okay? And that's what I got for my sass. Let me get you a spirit card, Sage. It's a good reading. It's a good week for you. Okay? Let's see what spirit wants to say. It says communicate honest and direct. Don't be ashamed. Set your boundaries. Remember it's okay to just say no. Okay? Gratitude. What did I tell you? You had attitude for gratitude this week. Remember when you remember when you want what you want, you have to now give thanks. Your grateful heart is a magnet to love and abundance. Okay? So like I said, you was grateful for all the experiences that you that you went through. It was a lesson learned. You communicate, okay? You was very communicatable about the things that you did not like and did not see that fit you. Let it go. Forgive yourself, forgive others, and don't let pain, guilt, or anger control you. So right now, you are definitely in your element. You let a lot of stuff go in your life, which is good, okay? You're definitely taking back your control with the self-love and patience in the middle of the deck. I like that. And that's what I got for my Sagittarius babies. Bye. Love the reading.